Smacks of Asa Strokosh and Joe Ansro for Scott Linley. Smashing of two heads. Fantastic win for Scotland, wasn't it? In Newcastle. Possibly just focus the mind for New Zealand, these Northern Hemisphere sides coming down to the Southern Hemisphere. Kian Healy head down, determined run from the loose head. Sexton. Oh, morning. To it. New Zealand wastes no time whatsoever in putting it down the line. Savia. Carney is there, McFadden is there, takes two island tacklers to bring down the youngster. Carter again. Metallic Thompson. Zach Guilford uses his pace to get away from the first tackle. Carter, Sonny Bill. No advantage. No advantage coming. Ireland are offside. Oh, we'll see what they do here. Aaron Smith is taking it quickly. Carter is there. Sonny Bill Williams. Just wave after wave now. New Zealand with a bit right between their teeth. But Ireland have won the penalty. There's one area of the game that Ireland are just about shading it over New Zealand it's at the breakdown it's another turnover and this time a penalty for Ireland chance to, to, to relieve the pressure but they're just coming in wave after wave after wave Rob Carney took it quickly and he possibly should have taken a little bit more time he straight down to Israel Dag and New Zealand come again on the attack and Ireland have to defend again it's energy sapping stuff Carter Guilford so physical out there as well. Rory Best got a foot in there and then picks up the loose ball as well. Let's go, Jules. Jules, get work. He hands through Peter O'Mahony. Now McFadden is chasing after this one. McFadden, all he needs to do is collect the ball, flop over the line, and he has. First try for Ireland on this tour. Uh, Ricocheted around, Rory bested so well, and McFadden kept chasing and chasing. He got a bit of luck, great try by McFadden, great chasing. Just had the legs for Richie McCall, had the pace, but uh, came from a turnover. We see here a little kick through by Carter, blocked by Rory Best, and he does brilliantly to get down on it. Little flick out by Peter O'Mahony, and great kick. All the All Blacks were upfield, and uh, there was only going to be one winner there. It's a lifeline for Ireland, one that they certainly needed. Not even Richie McCaw could stop that one. As you say, a lifeline. Ireland needed a score, and they have. Well, they've been under the cosh for the last, since half time. All Blacks come out in the second half, and they've been all over them. Just wave after wave of attack, and they've got a bit of fortune, a bit of good luck, and it might change, might give them that lift that they need. Ireland's turn to break away. And score a try against the run of play. Every point counts for Ireland. Johnny Sexton needs to get this one. And he has. 20 point game now. Concentration on Fergus McFadden's face. Not easy though. You know, everybody's watching the awkward bounce of the rugby ball. 